American Willys MB Jeep, one of the most legendary uh, field vehicles of the Second World War. Over 360,000 of them were made between 1942 and 1945. This particular Jeep was given to the British Red Cross Society in Italy by Lieutenant General Mark Clark, commander of the American Fifth Army, when he visited Sorrento and saw the Red Cross had no transport of their own. Uh, so this is a beautifully preserved and restored original Second World War MB Willis Jeep. It looks fantastic. When you need a guns and ammo reference guide with tech specs and ballistics, or gun values 30 to 100 percent, and to print out over 22,000 gun manuals, schematics, blueprints with dimensions, and old guns and ammo catalogs, go to firearmsguide.com. And it was a really, really, really amazing vehicle for that time. But even today, it would be so fun, so much fun to actually drive one around. Very simple vehicle, but effective. You could see where the modern Jeep design comes from. You know, if you own one, you'll be familiar with it. And let's check it out. You know, you had some tools like the axe and the shovel right here on the left-hand side. Seats were really simple, just some cushion on a steel frame, very simple steering wheel, and it was a stick shift, of course. Rear bench where you could sit probably two soldiers and probably two or four of them could sit on the on the each side behind the driver and co-driver. Very simple vehicle. And this for the African and Sicilian campaign had even the canvas roof, which no doubt prote uh, provides some protection from a sun, which was, you know, valuable. Beautifully, beautifully preserved Willis MB Jeep. Such a cute vehicle, <laughs> unbelievable. Look at from behind, even the spare tire, gas canister, 